And we are back. Uh, so, I decided after taking a quick nap, because I'm a, a lazy boy, that we would in fact jump in and just jump straight into Vault Hunters again and run another vault. Right. Terracotta, charcoal, rotten flesh, snowballs. Ugh. Oh, charcoal. No, no. That's fine. Uh... Two more snowballs needed. Oh, there was a lot of snowballs. Okay. Um, charcoal eight, I think it said. And then we just need more snow. Lovely. Put that away. Let's get running this vault. So if we remember, we need to get some burger pots, which should not be hard for us. Um, we'll keep all of this. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Wait, what? What happened? Where did my... What? Where did my soul, soul shard pouch go? Wait. What? What? What happened? What happened to my... Oh! <laughs> it's disappeared, right? I'm not going mad with that. We had it. We tried to move it. I think we clicked on our... Oh no, it's here. Okay, that was that was weird, um, but fine. Uh, let's get a couple of you. Let's say like 10. Oh, nope, don't want that. 10 of you. Let's get a stack and a stack. And we'll put our arrows here. Because that is nice and easy. We'll do that. We actually don't need to take the book with us, so we can probably put the pouch here, meaning that nothing will go on our hotbar, which is nice. And let's get vaulting, shall we? Uh, we've got our new pick with us to be able to break chests with, um, so we can see how well that works. Ooh, quests. Oh, that one's actually pretty good. 32 cratic iron, loads of netherite. And it's only seven zombies, so let's do that one. Uh, and let's jump right in. We got our better magnet with like good range. Uh, we're still looking for, of course, uh, a couple of things. Uh, mostly the ores to make pogs. These two. We don't need this, don't need this, don't need this. We're looking for these two. Um, oh, I've never seen this theme before. It's quite pretty. Uh, okay, so we're going to try our pick on some chests. It is rated for all chests. Oh, okay, also this is a... I didn't even mention it's a monolith vault. So that is one of the monoliths done. We need to mark our way out, because of course monolith vaults we need to leave. And let's have a look for some chests to mine, shall we? Here's some boys. Where are they spawning? We need to kill zombies, remember, so keep your eyes peeled for zombies. Uh, okay. Well, that works. I'm not... I think it would be nicer if it was faster, but it's not bad, actually. And considering we have our backpack on uh, with B, yeah, it's already picking up stuff. So this isn't bad. And the magnet gives us the range. Yeah, I'm not mad at this, actually. Oh, see, look at that. That felt fun. That was actually quite quick. It was just very slow. Is it not? No, it's got wood affinity. I think also, if we are mining, yeah, chests close to each other, it will mine multiple chests at once. This is a cool little, little room. Oh, I, I do feel like we're we're doing much better on looting now. What? Oh, okay, there it is. I see the slime now. There we go. Uh, yeah, let's get out of there. Okay. 
Uh, this, yeah, this feels like a much better way to loot than what we were previously doing, uh, especially with the backpack. We're not picking up half as much stuff anymore, which is good. Regenerate all our health. Oh, there looks to be digging stuff here. Is that everyone? Feels like that's everyone. Okay, get out our digging pick. And let's go to work. Oh, no, it's not the right one. I know it's one of the rare ores again, but it's not anything that we don't already have here. Okay. Oh, we stood right in that poison like an idiot. Uh, digging. Dig me in. Give me the good stuff. Ooh, that looks like Xenium. Right, okay. We now only need, technically, to hunt for uh, Gorgonite now, which is the little hearts one. So it's quite obvious to see if we find some, which is good. Oh, more Xenium. That might actually allow us to definitely get one, which would be good. Because, of course, we're not guaranteed one based on the fact that we've just um, found it. We still need to have a look. Um, we still need to mine it, obviously, and we could easily mine it and get no drops, unfortunately. But this, I love a mining room. I do find the mining probably the most satisfying thing. Especially when you can vein mine, like, just listen to all that popping of stuff hitting my inventory. Okay, well, no more useful stuff. Ah, here, I think. Yeah, here. Although I, I actually don't think this is a... Oh, maybe it is. I see the Illager. Oh, they're coming from behind this waterfall. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Let's just block our way for a second. Okay. Here they come. Right. There's the spawner. We got it. Okay. We got it. Heal. Okay. My god. What is this? Discovered the bottle modifier. I have no idea what's happening in here right now. But this is a, a solid room. Oh, there's another spawner. There's another spawner. There's another spawner. There has to be another spawner that we missed. Oh, man. Where's that spawner? Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, I got it. Are there other spawners? No, I think that's fine. Uh, so I think if we're smart and we do this, uh, we can actually vein mine. I don't think it's worth it. I think we're breaking more than we need to. So, Chapau, we didn't do our bounty, which is a bit sad, but we have definitely leveled up. <laughs> Perfect. Let's just chuck that in there for a second. Right, let's try and be reasonable with this. Um, but now we can do our monolith crate. Let's open that bad boy up. Let's have a look at lots of armor pieces, actually, and all common plus, which is nice. Uh, well, not all common plus, but that's fine. So axing, that's unfortunately too big for us. Item rarity, not great. Gilded affinity, that's actually quite good. Living affinity, too big. Gilded affinity too big. Uh, but we can put away the regret and the diamonds we got from that. Let's also roll these booster packs. Oh, we got a diamond essence. So that actually goes with our essences here. Nice. Uh, we can just chuck these away for now. 
uh, and shoveling. Check that away for now. That's fine. Let's roll our gear. How many do we have? 506. Ooh. Ooh. A couple epics. So let's have a look. So this is our... This is plus one chaining. It's actually pretty good. It's better damage. Let's have a... Let's do our usual. Uh, so if we hold this one. Currently doing 74. 77. I mean, it's, it's slightly worse, I guess. Um... This is the epic, though. Chaining 2, Arthropod's damage. It does have an empty prefix, um, so we could definitely try and fill that. Does this one have anything empty? No. The, the pants aren't going to really top our, our pants, I don't think. No, they're not. Uh, the hat, though, could top our, our hat, I guess. Our hat's not missing anything, is it? No, it's not. This is missing two suffixes, whereas the hat we actually have has th has three suffixes. So it's probably not much better. It ha oh, actually, to be fair, it's rolled a six on armor, uh, which is great. Uh, it's got decent dura- I mean, it might actually be better. Uh, maybe if we re-roll prefixes and suffixes, it could actually be a lot better. Uh, and then that sword was not good. So let's maybe take this quickly. Add a new random modifier. So this is actually missing two suffixes. So solvent, uh, uh, vault bronze, oh, uh, bronze, 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 bronze. We have loads of it, yeah, there we go. Uh, and mana regen, okay. But now let's maybe re-roll everything on it. Oh, uh, well, actually, yeah, health efficiency, armor, mana, item quantity, and mana region. That's not bad, actually. Yeah, I think that's actually pretty good. And let's have a look at us oh, wearing it, shall we? <laughs> it's actually quite cool. <laughs> Aha! <laughs> I think that's a new hat for us. Uh, so we can put that away for now. I think we put the rest of this away. The sword is good. It's... It's higher damage, slightly quicker attack speed. Good against undead, plus more... Oh, wait, no. I'm looking at the wrong one. Oh, this is because it's got a prefix of more damage. Whereas this does chaining attack. Uh, and it's only got one suffix, and the suffix on this, yeah, no, it's not better. It's no, no, nowhere near better. Um, don't even know why that was a, a question when I actually started to look into it. So, let's break down all of this base stuff first. So remember, fortune. So it'd be fortune five, based on the fact that we have the expertise point in fortune. So that has given us plenty of lovely stuff. Now... We don't really care too much about these two, but we did get two, actually. No, we we could do with more of the yellow, because that's the only thing that's slowing us down to make more right now. Uh, okay, so one Escalium, three Bomb Ignite, one more Penzanite, three more Ashium, Seven Ashium. Okay, this is the important one. We need at least one of these. Two would be better. Two? Eight. Okay, that's huge. So, if I look, this one is the bottom one here. Then we've got that. Then we've got that. 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 And that. Okay, so still needing more... Uh, I need the key. Wait, I need the key to... Highlight it with numbers. Uh, bam. So we've got 8 there, 8 there, 23 there, Christ. Honestly, if we could... We, we could almost make at least 8 of each. We're missing a couple of this one, the Sparkle Teen, I think, yeah. Um, and a fair few of that, but now all we're missing... We're not hunting this anymore. 
We're just hunting Gorgonite to be able to make our pog. Oh. I tell you, that is going to be a tough hunt that we're on. Because it is not coming up right now. Oh, but we have all the stuff in here as well. So we can whiz all of this out. Lovely. And we can put all of this away. Uh, we do need to make the burgers, though, for our questing. So let's make... Oh, no, I don't want the lemons. Uh, let's make the burgers that we can, because we may as well, because it might level us up again. Because we're going to get 10 burgers from this level. This one is just saying reach level 10, which we've already done. So let's see if this will definitely level us up. 100%. 99% The cheek of it! <laughs> okay, fair enough. <laughs> and this is saying, uh, apply a seal of the sage to a vault crystal. Oh, okay, so how do you, sorry, how do you apply? Combining a vault crystal and a seal and anvil will set the objective. I see, okay. And this is seal of the sage. So we need to make another crystal. Let's chuck those away. What does it want? Uh, okay, gravel, sugar cane, God. and charcoal. Okay, well, gravel, sugar cane, and charcoal should be fine. Gravel, ugh, sugar cane, that might not even be enough. Uh, charcoal. And then we gotta fly out to where we found the cods again. That isn't even enough, is it? No. That's fine, though. We can chop some down on the way. Well, let me let me get my wings again. Uh, and I will fly to go and kill some cods again. Somewhere like... I think it was over here. That's fine. Chuck this there. Chuck, oh, tab down. Chuck that there. That's complete. Let's put the rest of this stuff away. Uh, bam, bam. Bam. Shwam. Shwam. Need those arrows. Put that there. Let's complete our crystal and then apply the seal. Which is something we've never done. Because I'm happy with the randomness of it. Oh, not a chicken. Elixir Vault. So now we can go back into our book, and it says basically combining crystals with seals and anvil will set the objective. Da, 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 da. Elixir function as a task. Once you have filled your elixir bar, yes, yes, yes. And we get two blank seals. Perfect. Complete. God altars. Complete a god altar. Sure thing. We can do that. Do you think if I place these in the vault, they'll give me vault loot? I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, let's get ourselves ready for this vault. Uh, food. Let's take these off our hotbar for a second. Put that there. Put that there. Put this away. Uh, let's actually just eat one of these. Plus, do a little heal. Okay, I'm ready. So it's going to be an elixir vault, so that's fine. Let's jump on in. We're definitely leveling from this. We are two seconds away from leveling normally. Uh, and let's see. What does this do? Still nothing? You are useless to me. Uses. Nothing. I don't want to. I'm going to throw you away the first chance I get. This is a cool vault, though. A little underwater vault. Probably not going to be able to kill zombies here again, though, are we? Ugh. Which is just as much of an aggravation. Ooh, uh, Mother Spider. We need to cheese this. We need to cheese this badly. It's fine. That's fine. As long as we can deal with the spiders one-on-one, -on -one, we can then... Oh, no. They are killing me, though. Spiders are my nemesis. Okay. Ooh. Right. 
the rest of you guys. Okay? There we go, dead. Oh no, I forgot about the baby spiders that spawn. I forgot about the baby spiders. Oh god, 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 god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've never been so close to death at the start of a vault. Okay. Okay. Mother of god. What was going on? Hello? Nobody drop on me, please. Okay, you. You're the last remnant of that horrible time we just had. Okay, so there's a vault, uh, a god altar, which we need to complete anyway, so that's cool. Still looking for the Gorgonite, obviously. We can test our new pick, which is nice, on the wooden chests. Uh, so let's do that now. It's the same, okay. Well, we tried. It's a bit of a shame because we've wasted a slot now on probably what could have been speed, but you live and you learn. What was he? Oh my god. Kill that quickly. I have no idea what that is. Uh, let's do our dash and see if we can't dash ourselves up here. Lovely. Heal up again. I have been thinking recently about possibly taking the expertise that gives us... Um, that gives us uh, god affinity. Because I think maybe it would be nice to have some affinity with the gods. Um, because they do actually offer a fair bit if you can build it up nicely. Um, like protection and stuff from various things and stuff in life. Ooh, that was bad. We have no full protection on our boots. Uh, but that's fine. Let's just eat up and move on. No zombies again, which is probably the biggest frustration ever, because I thought that would be such an easy quest to do. Um, but we did kill the giant spider, so who's winning now? Six minutes, and we already know where the exit is, so feeling quite happy now. No real stress. Even with these guys coming at me, it's like we're strong enough now where we can kind of just mess around a little bit. Uh, see if there's anything around here. That just leads to here, no problem. Uh, there's some stuff over there, lovely. I was like, we definitely haven't looted this whole bottom floor. <gasps> Such a defender. JK, you died trying. Lovely. Um, there, is, it does take away a little bit um, the digging the chests, obviously, from like finding some really cool stuff and like opening the chests and getting the like surprise ding. But at the same time, ugh, uh, the how slow that is at this point, it's not worth it. I think we're done. Wave, vault complete. I almost said wave. Vault complete. Assist your allies. Six, five, four. Three, two, one. Thirteen thousand. How much did we get for killing the spider queen? Elite spider, eight, sorry, uh, 1,800. Wait, one. Oh yeah, because we got 13,000, sorry. I was like, what? Claim. <laughs> so that did ding us once, I think only. But fair enough, I mean, I'm not, I wasn't expecting the world. Uh, so let's, just because we've got the room, let's straight away open this. Let's have a look. Ornate, wooden, picking, uh, item, reach, picking. Oh, it's actually not a bad picking. It's very cheap. Pretty bad, though, overall. That's fine. Let's chuck these away. Uh, yep, yeah, okay. Let's now put down our shulker boxes. Uh, da 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 da. How many do we have of these? 770. 
we could buy a mod box as well. Actually, let's do that. So a mod box is, as it says there, it contains a random modded item from any of your unlocked mods. Now, we've of course unlocked not many mods right now. We've literally unlocked two in storage and one in pouches, but we could buy it now and wait until maybe we've got something better to use it on. But it was quite cheap. We had the stuff to do it. So it's one of those like, why not, right? So let's do some rolling of stuff, shall we? Let's roll our shield and our helmet. Check our no real goodies. Uh, just rusty stuff. It's all pretty bad. Uh, check that in there. Then let's go over here. And we can quickly chuck these away while also grabbing... We should probably not keep it in here. But pick real quick. Uh, fortune. Oh, not that one. Silly goose. That one, right? Fortune 3, lovely. Lovely. Grab all of that. We can then put that away, that away. Put the Wootenite away. Uh, we can then complete this quest. Interact with a black market, which we can do. Perfect. And it gives us the stuff and it will put it straight into here for us. Lovely. Knowledge. Obtain a knowledge star, which will get us another mod box. So we can probably do this. Let's have a go. One, two, three, four. One plus then this. Oh, perfect. Exactly enough. Uh, this goes here with these around it to make the core. Then these go around this to make that. So I think now probably I can take these off of my to-do list because I know how to make these sorts of things, um, which is good. We can now, uh, let's just use this. One unspent knowledge. Perfect. If we come here, this will give us a mod box, which again, we don't really want to open right now because we don't have any good mods. And now reach level 20. At level 20, they'll give us another knowledge star, which is good. But now we're caught up with the quest book. In which case, let's have a quick look. So we do have one point. I'm not sure what we should be heading towards next if I'm honest um, there's a couple different things I think weird gadgets would be a good one but they're quite expensive um, mechanism would be one actually that I'd like to unlock um, so this requires mechanism which is probably here. Yeah. So wait, so you need to pay six. Then you need to pay eight. What do you get for this? It provides you with ore processing. Okay. Well, that's very far off. But that, I think, is maybe what we save towards now. Um, let's get our, our chest chicken. Oh, actually... We never looked at this. We keep forgetting that we have the backpack on. So we can whiz all of this out. We need to... We need to get one bun. Put this here. Because it is cluttering a little bit. Uh, but now, we can pull this away as well. Which is good. Uh, do that, do that, do that. Uh, do that, do that, do that, do that. Uh, that, that, that. It was starting to feel like we weren't getting good stuff, if I'm honest. Because I keep forgetting to empty this. Uh, we can chuck you guys in there for a second. Uh, then that and that. That. We've got our nuggies. We could process some of these, to be fair. Uh, that and that. Lovely. What? 
yeah, I mean, we've got plenty of nuggets, but there's no there's no need to process them right now. Um, if we get full on them, we can process them into the stuff below, basically, because that's what they make into. Besides these, which are diamonds, and these, which are uh, vault nuggets, which we don't actually have a vault uh, or a vault ingot um, thing, so we don't have many of them. Uh, it doesn't feel that useful. These are both normal things that don't belong in here. And I think that's everything. Yeah, let's chuck this away. Let's have a look at what we've got. We've got tons of stuff. We could definitely, like, we could have a good start at Mechanism if we could unlock that mod. But we'd need, we'd need so much of this stuff. Um, so if we, let's make a sign. Wait. Uh, I think we've probably got a sign. Yeah, right. Let's take this. And let's just slap this here for a second. Uh, yeah, here. So, to make a knowledge star... Knowledge. Star. Uh, I think if I... Yeah, I can always edit this again. So we need... Uh, so to make one... We need 9 times 8, so 81 Knowledge Essence. So, 81, no, it's not going to fit in, is it? No, S. 81, no, S. Uh, we need 8 Volt Diamonds, 8 V die. 8 V die. Uh, And then we need, what, 16? Oh wait, yeah, 4 times 4, so 16 then. And then 16 then. Then. So, for us to get what we need right now, we want another... We want another, what, five to get mechanism? Yeah, another five to get mechanism. So we need right now... Let's get the calculator out. Uh, right. So we want 81 times five. So 405. So we need 405 uh, S. We need... Uh, I don't know why I need to do that. 40 volt diamonds, uh, and then we need 16 times 5 is 80, then, uh, then, and this is the die. Die. Um, so we currently have enough Beniatite, uh, slightly under the amount of Vault Diamonds, um, and no Vault Essence. Cool. Okay, well, that's a target at least. Um, we still have one Expertise point, which I think we're going to put into Divine. I think it feels good, and we have also two Skill Points to spend. Which, I think putting them into witchery is the good idea. It just feels right. So we're going to do that so we can get more coins, so we can maybe start to buy some more stuff. Um, so we've got witchery now. Um, and we should... oh. Oh, oh. We didn't get all of this out, apparently. Uh, oh my god, the shield's dead. Ten durability left. Okay. Good to know. Um, do we have another shield that would be good? Uh, anything that's like a rare? 
No, we don't have that many shields. This is probably like the next best thing. It would be nice if we could re-roll the suffix though. Uh, but that's going to re-roll... Oh no, that should only re-roll the suffix, right? Knockback resist. Weakness cloud when hit. Knockback resist. Oh, we're needing uh, plating. Yeah, do you not know chuck both of those in? And we're needing money as well. Uh, let's just grab that. Do that, do that. There we go. Oh my god. An explosion of bronze. Uh, weakness cloud. Soulbound. 12% knockback resist is pretty good, I guess. 14% knockback resist. Weakness cloud plus one hit, fine. I think we probably wasted a fair bit to get to there. Um, but that's fine. What we will do is we will jump back down. Because it's too expensive to repair gear right now at this level. Um, and we can actually look and see... We need to basically enchant like, all three of these things. So that's 15, probably like 20, and then uh, so that's 35, 40 emeralds is probably what I need to um, to be able to enchant all of those. So I'll do that off camera. Um, it's probably just going to be me mining stone and then selling it. Is the It's the quickest way for me to get um, emeralds. Because this guy just buys 20 at a time. Nice and easy. You just come over here. Bang. And I've got the levels now to be able to probably do all of the enchanting. So I'm going to go. It was wonderful having this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I see you in the next one. And see you then. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video. I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything. Go, go wild. <laughs>